Now you need to understand that there are different people with different heart postures towards me and their actions reflect that heart posture. I've had people prostrate themselves in front of me. Peter, Mary, Judas. In the previous video, I confirmed everything that I'm talking about in scripture I am supposed to be talking about. I get that people don't want a yes. Notice my expression. Yes. True. But. Answer. In my kingdom, people actually ask me for permission to do something. I hear different prayers from different aspects from different people, all dealing with issues that revolved around separating from their kingdom marriage. And there are those that still pray. And there is the last day that we are living in. Olympics. So when you have someone that focuses you, and that's me, here is what we are doing in my remnant. Here is what the kingdom of heaven is doing, beloveds. And then we have scriptural words recognized in English that mean something. And that ties back to an encompassing display of, well, spiritual discipline. But that is first appreciated from someone that understands the Holy Spirit leads you a certain way. And then there's those that cannot and they cannot because it was already known that they would not and we have a war and we have the impact What I've been doing is leading my people <clears throat> through their reconciliations. And I've been telling them, my people, my people, my people, don't reopen a wound. And the scripture says that I would bind up the wounds of the brokenhearted. That I have healed you from. by bringing up your partner, as in this is your teammate, this is your God-ordained, specified especially for you, for my purposes, spouse, says transgressions against you. They already know. I have reminded them. And scripture says, I will remove your guilt and shame. It also says something about... <clears throat> no, this is not witchcraft. It's in the scripture. A white stone. <clears throat> And a cord of three strands is not easily broken, and I do not do this capriciously. And it's time I make all things beautiful. That's what it says. <clears throat> so having the separation.
is and was led by the one who is and was to come and now here. From the perspective that you may have right now, you are only looking at your earthly existence and enjoyment revolving around the focus being on your earthly existence, your enjoyment. Whereas the heavenly teachings teach, I have food you know nothing about. My food is to do the will of my Father. If you do not work, you do not and all of the decisions that I had told my kingdom spouses, your spouse needs to eat. Regain their spiritual strength. And that can only be accomplished by entering my rest. And to enter my rest, they will need to be near you. Because I am only in you. I am only in my remnant. I am focused on the new heaven, the new earth. You are vital and integral. So you were not fired. You were not. Missed. Taken. Into the air. When you. Have the advocate. That's your barrier against my judgment. My spirit in you is going to advocate with me you already paid for it. The reason for having this scripture if my people will humble themselves I will hear from heaven and scripture in Proverbs says wisdom created heaven you can rest assured you are getting godly wisdom for your day at this exact moment and your encouragement of what you do not know about tomorrow Simply put, I've been teaching my people, my yoke is easy and my burden is light. Just do this and I'll do the rest. When we are discussing visible me, my dunamis, my power, it's explained in the scripture very, very simply. With man, this is impossible. With God, all things are possible. You having one circumspect and not offensive to God way of life gives you the certainty and assurance that God's judgment is not going to be on you. Bless this home with love and laughter or your household. No harm, no evil will come near your door. to specify in Christ as it has been understood and remain with that being the limit that you allow yourself to feel safety and security is the reason why 
the decision was made in these, in these videos. It was 2013, I shaved off my cornrows. The designation of the judgment has begun. So we're in 2000, I'll mark this video with the timeline, 24, we're approaching the year, I'll say that, <clears throat> that's going to be exponentially more exuberant and joyful and filled with all of the fruit and the blessings that you have stored up in heaven, all of the results of your work are going to be seen in your life. I'm going to be returning my soldiers to their families. I'm going to have that reconciliation revolving around your kingdom union with me through you and your spouse, you are going to be seen as a success. So you'll have the favor of heaven. You'll have favor with man. Everything that I promised. <clears throat> Your reconciliation is the entire <clears throat> answer to uh, declining birth rates, um, marriages staying together, thus loving their little ones with the love of Christ, preventing the excess of <clears throat> the rebellion against loving God and what that yields. You will have <clears throat> the witness and the experience that your spirit will retain. Most of all, that's one of the most important aspects of my heavenly teachings and why many were taken into the air. And then um, there's times I lead my prophets to do it. I do the same. I want you to use your own testimony. I want you to use your own situation right now. <clears throat> the authentic Christian walk is displayed in your life. Depending on what level you are at and what you are learning, there is someone that has gone through it. And the reason you are coming to them and listening to them as your shepherd or your mentor or your Elijah. When I was uh, going through the modern church system, a word was spoken over me by someone that sat under Perry Stone. No one can touch your harvest. Your pastor can't touch your harvest. That was before 2000. That was 2013. And then all kinds of things started happening. So <clears throat> words that were spoken over you coming into fruition. Words that might have been delivered to depending on the type of home, land. Uh, was it a nuclear family? Was it a mixed family? Mine was mixed 2,000 years ago. The, that's very, very important because that will tell you a lot about how set apart my family was. You will also um, <clears throat> a 
be seen <clears throat> by what you do because others do it as well. You're going to see an entirely different love in your kingdom marriage, first of all, when it is truly focused on my will. You are also going to see my hand on your life and not on others, which is part of why I made the previous video about, okay, well, it is the holiday season. People are going to do this. Someone needs to provide clarification. <clears throat> When you understand all of this was already created for you to be able to withstand the darkest times humanity has ever faced or will ever face again, is the incidents that you'll remember and you'll tell your little ones and you'll always be able to parallel it back to the scripture when you're teaching your little ones they are going to have a different respect and understanding of why you are teaching them what you are teaching them and see you as the prominent patriarch, fathers, husbands, <clears throat> and you'll see how mothers teach their daughters. Well, I submit to your husband, but he earned it, and this is why. The admiration that you both have in terms of levels for each other previous to what you've been through to what you have now what you will continue to grow that love and your example and how your little ones treat their siblings all of these experiences i had two thousand years ago <clears throat> And in this age, colored my um, motives and reason for creating the kingdom marriage, beloved. Living it and judging it, living it and judging it, living it and judging it. At the same time, creating the change for humanity, I have always done. So, what you're doing now is setting something amazing into motion <clears throat> for my name's sake should be your that doesn't mean that God doesn't love me of course he's doing it for his name's sake he's chosen me should and does have a profound experience for you all of it all of the drops of my love and um, tangible emotions that you get to feel others don't because you are alive the gift of eternal life is barely understood by you everlasting life is everlasting life so I uh, decided to make sure that in my teachings post cross the last 2000 years so that man can understand time exists for man <clears throat> and then how you because many could say well lord if you knew everything and 
everything Eve was ever going to do. So that was Eve. That was the beginning of Eve. I am the beginning of creation. The origin and the beginning of the creation of God is what the scripture says. God became flesh. Behold. So, <clears throat> once you understand my love, you can give it to your spouse. And many have been teaching obedience without question. And then you see why. Because you don't know what my Holy Spirit is telling your spouse or has revealed about you to your spouse. I love you.